Hello, this is Mr. Craig, and the purpose of this video is to show you how to upload or to load in your OneNote notebook for your chemistry class. First of all, go to your Office 365 account, and for some of you, you may have to access that through your school webpage. And this video was made in the fall of 2016, so go to the Explore button on the website, find your quick links, click on Office 365, and I'm already logged in or signed in to my Office 365, so my email should pop up. If you don't see Outlook, go to the waffle or this little thing over here in the top left-hand corner, click on it and click on your mail. So once you are in your Outlook account, look for the email from me, Mr. Craig or Matthew Craig, and I am going to upload a notebook from period three. So once you click on the email that I sent to you after you've received this, if you haven't received this email, you may want to check your clutter or your spam or your junk email, whatever it's called. Um, and sometimes you might find it in there. So that's another place to look. If you don't see it in your inbox or your clutter or your spam, or maybe you deleted it in your deleted folder, then talk with Mr. Craig and see, hey, did you actually send me a notebook? Because it's possible I may not have. So here's the email. It says, Matthew Craig has shared 2016 Chemistry Honors A period three. So this is the beginning of the year. Scroll down and then you'll notice that this is highlighted a little bit. So click on that actual link here. And you'll see that the hand, it goes from an arrow to the hand. Click on that. Be patient here. It might take a, a few seconds for it to load up depending on how fast your internet is or if everybody's doing this in the school at the same time. All right, that looks fine and dandy, but this is not where we want to be. So next thing is to click where it says edit in OneNote. And since again, this is the fall of 2016, the recent update for OneNote looks like this. So this is the OneNote 2016. And you'll notice that it's loading and it's going to take a little bit of time. So what's going to happen is this might take somewhere between 5 to 10 seconds to 5 to 10 minutes, depending on your Wi-Fi speed. So we'll come back to this as soon as it's uploaded. All right, so a few minutes have passed by, and I believe the reason why it took me so long for the upload is because I'm uploading a class notebook. So once you see this, you may like the 2016 version. It'll take me a little getting used to, but that's okay. You can go over to the top left-hand corner where you see the three lines, click on it, and it should show you all of your notebooks if you have uploaded multiple notebooks. So this is a class notebook. That's why you see so many. But here's the period three that I just loaded, and if you click on it, then that should appear, and that's what we're looking at. Now, if you like using the 2013 version of OneNote, which is okay, uh, it still does the same thing, then you can go to the um, the app, click on 2013. I kind of like it. It's, it's a little simplistic, but it works for me. And you should be able to view all your notebooks here. Now, if you don't see it, like here I'm looking for 2016 Chemistry Honors A period three. I don't see that. So what I want to do is go to File and then Open. And then I want to go to Recent Notebook. So I just synced it, but it the 2013 can't find it. So we click on it. So again, let me go back. So you go to File, Open, look over down here. You may have to scroll down a little bit to where it says Recent Notebook. Click on it, and then it will take a little bit of time to load up. Not as long as the first time. So, okay, that didn't take very long at all. So now there's the 2013 version. And we now have our period three, and I want to keep all these in order. So I'm going to shuffle that up. So now you can see my AP and now my honors, uh, period three and period four. I need to upload one more, which would be period two, and then I'll have all my notebooks. But that should help out with that. If you're having trouble syncing your notebooks, here's another trick that you could use. So actually go back to your Office 365 account. Um, and go back to the waffle, click on the waffle, go to your OneDrive, and once you're, once you've clicked on the OneDrive, you'll see sync up here, here we go, so sync, click on that, and that should sync all of your files as well. But again, 
it all starts back with the email, clicking on the email, and uh, that should help you out. Okay. I hope that uh, this video has been very helpful. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask. And again, if you don't see it in your mail or your inbox, check your clutter. You may have accidentally deleted the email. Ask Mr. Craig, say, hey, I'm new to the class, or maybe I, you just registered, got into the class recently, and I need to add you. Hope this video was helpful. Have a great day.